Alright, so, now we're up in episode 3 of what's changed around here. Uh, taking out the second hill, not entirely done replacing the ground level stone with dirt. But, since we now have such an incredible amount of stone, um, I've decided that my first little clubhouse on this side is going to be stone instead of wood. But, if I'm going to use stone, then I might as well take advantage of one of the other mods that I have installed, which is the chisel mod. Um, and the chisel mod uh, opens up all manner of really cool bricks. Um, I also have, oh crud, I'm trying to remember the name of it, um, carpenter's blocks, which I haven't gotten to play around with at all yet. So... But, to use either of these, we will need iron, uh, because iron for a chisel, and uh, just kind of in general, to get some of the our next tier of weapons, we could use an upgrade. So, what I'm going to go ahead and do is uh, spend a little bit of time in this mine that we've barely started over here, but started nonetheless. Um, I'm probably just going to go ahead and see while I'm here if I can just go ahead and get down to uh, Bedrock and do, uh, <clears throat> if I can get, get diamonds, um, I need eight of them because I also have equivalent exchange three and that's what it requires for the Minimus Stone which allows us to transmute some of this extra dirt up. So I'm going to get to work on that. Um, and if we uh, make some good progress, I may do another little update. I know I said that I would have, I would start building uh, the base, but that's when I was assuming that I would do it with wood. And now I'm not doing it with wood, I'm doing it with stone. But to do it with stone, I need iron. So, you know, it's one of those never-ending, always need what you don't have. Uh, so, we'll work on that, and uh, I'll give you updates once we get to them. But that'll give me some time to uh, do all this boring mining stuff. You guys don't want to sit here and watch me mine for hours on end while I get down to bedrock and get diamonds set up. But that's what we're going to do and when we come back hopefully we'll have equivalent exchange and we just need one iron for the chisel so if, uh, if the diamond adventure doesn't go very well then We'll just come back and we'll start building the house. And if it does go well, then I'll show you guys that. And uh, we'll get into equivalent exchange. And we'll really start making some progress and, and getting into using build craft. And, and maybe trying to even find our uh, our real, real next base location. So we'll just have to wait and see how things go. Anyway, uh, I will be back when we have a little bit of progress to document. So, that did not take very long at all. We hit bedrock pretty quick, not too far out there, so I guess we're at a fairly low spot. Um, and we got this. Since I hit bedrock, I usually go up a few steps uh, to make sure that I'm not swimming in lava or digging in lava. Dang it, there's another one. I did get blown up by a creeper earlier, and there goes another one. Um, to any of you who were notice things a little quicker than I did. Um, I was standing right on top of iron when, uh, hey, rat, get off me. Uh, when I, when I ended the recording last time, I was standing right on lava, or not on lava, iron, burp. So we've got a little bit of iron now. Um, probably going to come back for some of this. I just want to make sure things don't spawn on top of me. What is that? potash. We'll come back to that later. Oh, but I don't have a pickaxe, which is what I actually meant to go back upstairs and build when I happen chanced back across this. So, I do need to make sure. Uh, one thing you may notice is I generally do torches on the left, um, or on the ground in this case, because I want to make sure and highlight that. Torches on the left mean that as long as I travel with light on my right, home is in sight. So, 
it's a good way to keep me from getting lost, especially early on, until I uh, get um, colored wool and stuff in place so that I can have colored pathways. Um, going to go ahead and start on another pickaxe or two. Or three. And then we're also going to make another stove over here, a furnace. And start, uh, start processing some of this iron. So, because I need armor, something fierce. Um, probably could use another, uh, sword as well, but hopefully we won't hit any more spawned guys just yet. Of good note, I did get some redstone when the last creeper that blew up and opened that nice doorway for me. Um, he blew up a couple of redstone blocks and allowed me to collect some off of it, so. We're gonna go ahead and smash into some more of this iron here. Uh, hopefully get enough to get us, we're looking at needing a chisel, definitely, which, I mean, that's one, so that's easy. Leave salt for now. Uh, then we're, I really want to look at armor. Um, I'm not even so much concerned about a sword as I am just having some defense so things don't blow up on me. And we are a fair distance from our base, and... As I've said before, and we'll say again, the monsters at night are crazy ridiculous. When you have uh, mostly the the mo monsters, it just adds it adds so many nice neutral spawns, but a just absolute ton of uh, evil nasty monsters. So, like the werewolves, werewolves will tear you in half real quick. So, I hear groaning. You know, actually, I should... A bucket is also going to be really high on the list because... I'm really worried about... There's, there's like, these lava demon things. And... They're probably one of the most dangerous monsters. Because I can die and go get some of my stuff back. But lava demons literally throw like chunks of lava at you and you die all your gear is gone so very not fun that you can hear werewolves howling somewhere in the distance likely somewhere where we could break through uh, so we're gonna be nice and careful with no armor <laughs> and uh, terrible gear in making sure that we just kind of take things slow. So I have also been collecting about as much coal as I can because I'm going to want nice chiseled stone soon. Um, right now, I think, I, I mean, we'll try it out. We'll try the chisel on some cobblestone uh, because I know there are some various different kinds of cobblestone we can get. But... Uh, for later, I'm definitely going to want the the baked stone, just the standard stone blocks uh, with a chisel make for some really interesting uh, different effects with the chisel. There's lots of really cool skins, I guess, on the stone. Lots of good mapping, so... I definitely want to be able to take advantage of that. I also want to make sure I put as much light out here as I can. I don't really like having a torch on the left there, so we'll just put it there. And let's hope that I don't get eaten. This is where um, better bows would come in really handy for areas like this, where I can't see. Okay, well, that's not actually as bad as I thought it was, so... I'm not going to be picking up any of these special ores yet, partially because I need at least an iron pickaxe, I think, for some of them. And I'm not even going to try, because I know 
some of the special ores in metallurgy and uh, thumbcraft uh, will mine as if they were stone, like at the speed of stone, but you actually have to have a higher graded pickaxe to get them. And that means a lot of wasted uh, wasted material, and I don't really feel like wasting anything right now. Things are pretty plentiful with these mods installed, which is good. But anytime we don't have to waste, we might as well not. And I'm lucky I didn't just jump down into the lava there. So let's go ahead and pick up copper too. Might as well. Oh, there that goes. All right, well, we're not doing that. Not even messing with that right now. That's why I go up a few steps, because I would rather mine down into lava than up. Mining up into lava, super bad deal. So We're also starting to get pretty hungry, and I don't have... Ooh, actually, I think I have some fish cooking at home. I went... I didn't have a fishing rod, but you can stab plenty of fish in the face with uh, the sword and that's helpful so 23 there we got 42 here so we've got some levels um let's just go ahead and take all this back up and i'll even take the extra furnace not that i can't make more but hey might as well take what we've got while we've got it oh I did not realize I was a step off here. I'll be right back. 